Welcome, this is Phil from The Gravity. This is the Canon HD10 um, unboxing. I don't normally like, sorry, wrong screen. I don't normally like unboxing videos because they're quite boring. Um, and the only reason why I'm doing this is because I've been given on trial a Canon HD10, which is the hard drive version. And I'm looking around now for my uh, scissors, but I'll use something else. It is the hard drive version of um, their latest HD camera. Now, I actually have a, a Canon HV20, which is the tape drive one. Um, just quickly before I get into this and open this baby up, um, Holly from CanonCameraBuzz.com basically got in touch with me. She'd been watching my videos, my vlog on uh, dm.blip.tv and uh, had been following my new media in, uh, me, new media media if you want to call it that and uh, watched my videos from Punk Camp Boston and basically got in touch and said would I like to be one of the people try, trying or trialling out the um, for 30 days the, the Canon and uh, which I find absolutely fantastic I mean it's almost like an additional Christmas present really um, so I get to play with this over Christmas and shoot some video and post it on the internet and and do more media and, and so for video blogging and the reason why I do citizen journalism this is what I've been sort of building up to do I would love to do you know testing out and trialing stuff so let's get straight in here this is uh, straight from Canon itself and uh, a little DHL notice in here that's that's for the return for sending it back via DHL so I need that I need to save that Okay, nicely packed. I'm not going to do that usual stuff where we, uh, you know, it does this, it does that, it has the box like this. Oh god, I love opening boxes. Something about opening boxes. So there we go, the Canon HD camera system, which is HD10, and it's the uh, extended recording, 40 gig. So that's quite a lot of space. Um, let me go on the back of here. Battery duration, uh, it's all in different languages, We're not English. Uh, various stuff, Vista, XP, blah, blah, blah. Um, I've heard through the grapevine and through camera, uh, CanonCameraBuzz.com, uh, which you should go look at, by the way, it, it, this is the start of companies realizing that they can give products to the community and have people who are experts or know how to use these things, who are actively using them, uh, and give recommendations straight back to the company. So uh, props to Holly for setting up uh, that site, all to do with Canon stuff. I think there's going to be a lot more sites like that. OK, so you get the usual stuff that you never read or never look through. Well, I don't, anyway, which is this big segment of paperwork and CDs and stuff. Um, Yuli DVD Movie Factory, I think they're forced to put these things in. Backup utility, digital video solution, don't need any of that. And I don't even need to read a manual. I think the best way to use a device is to just get on there and, and use it. However, the thing that I must do is get all this stuff together. Because if I'm sending it back, I don't want to lose any of it. So, let's just get that stuff over there. Right, okay. So, first of all, comes with a HDMI cable. Wow. Straight in the box. They've obviously been listening to people. HDMI cable, gold plated by the looks of it on the end. Nice. Um, the actual camera itself, there's, there's loads of stuff here. There's a battery, there's a strap, all that sort of stuff. But well, you want to see the camera, right? So let's, let's bring the camera out. And uh, have I got my, my Canon HV20? First impressions is that, um, wow, that's small. It's it looks a little bit wider, it looks a little bit wider than my uh, HV20, but um, the balance of it is very nice. One thing, first impression, first thing, um, why do, I, I presume it's a space thing, but why do they put the mic on the top? Surely when you're shooting somebody, you're, you're taking audio in from the front, not on the top. So I don't know why manufacturers do that. It's almost like an afterthought, but uh, we'll have a look around, see if we can find an external mic input beautiful looking carbon carbon looking bit on the back if you can see that that's where the 40 gig drive is there's a little flap there for the hdmi hdmi uh we've got component out 
Got component uh, the HDMI out there. Oh, got a little bit of bleed there. Sorry about that. And um, yeah, looks pretty much the same as the HV20. It's got a viewfinder in it. Uh, it says on the side, full HD 1080. If you can see all that there. Oh, got a bit of light coming in again. Let me see all that. A full HD instant AF Canon 40 gig uh, hard drive. 15 hours on long play and 11.5 hours on slow play. So, I mean, for somebody who is traveling, I think this would be perfect because one, you get in HD quality video and you are, you know, you only have to charge it. You don't have to take it off your computer or worry about that. I suppose that is a bit of a worry over time if you're traveling for weeks on end and it's all on here. This is quite a valuable thing to, to look after. But I do like what they've done with the drive. I mean, that's, that's obviously a 2.5 inch drive form factor in there. They've, they managed to shoe that, shoehorn that in quite nicely there. But um, yeah, first impressions, pretty, pretty nice screen. Nice little, I'm not sure what that uh, jog dial thing is there. But uh, I don't know if you can see that. The features are the same. This is the same layout as on the HV20. You got the backwards and the forwards and there's a function tab there now. And the same thing, mini SD card for taking photos, USB connector there. Didn't like the same as the HV20. I didn't like the way that the battery compartment worked. It's it, it's almost like something out of Battlestar Galactica where things are supposed to fly into there. It's it looks a bit precarious. I, I don't know why they haven't put like a little lip along the bottom of it so it holds the battery because the battery, although it it fits into a slot, it it doesn't. It seems like a bit of an afterthought. The battery. Um, and I would have liked to have seen the battery to be a bit slimmer and a bit more sort of a, a lithium based one or something like that. And then move that, the mic from the top to the front. But uh, let's have a quick look around here. There's, there's another great stuff. Uh, that, that, that is good. They've actually put a little hole on the front for an external mic. I don't know if you can see that. There is actually an external mic uh, hole there on the front which is great. I don't think there is one on the HV20. I'll have to look into that. Uh, the one thing I liked about this that on the HD, uh, HD20, uh, 10, which was on the HV20, is that they've got the light on the front. And the light was brilliant on the HV20. So, so that's the unboxing. Uh, I'm going to charge up the battery. And uh, oh, by the way, it's got a nice little rocker on the top for fast forward and that. That's really nice. But uh, nice and shiny. It's got a hot shoe on the top. Um, yeah, can't wait to play with it. Looks good. Right, so that's the uh, HG10, and I've got a 30 day trial from now, from today, and I will be posting my videos on Vimeo on their HD side of the site. I will also be posting um, Twitter updates on twitter.com forward slash Canon HD10, and I will also be uploading the videos to blip at Canon HD10.blip.tv. So I've been Philip Campbell. I do a show called The Gravity, which will be relaunching soon once the new design's done. Uh, thanks for joining me. See you later.